We begin tonight following developing news after a fire broke out at a condominium complex on North Beach. Firefighters responding to the scene around 2:30 this afternoon, battling flames amid scorching temperatures. And it's where we find our Bill Churchill joining us live tonight with what all we know at this hour about this fire. So, Bill, what can you tell us? Still a very active scene. OK, I'm getting some someone talking in my ear right now. It's some, a, still a very active scene out here. I want to point this in uh, this direction right here. You can see firefighters are rehabbing right over here. We're not seeing that billowing smoke like we saw earlier this afternoon. It was right around 2.30 when we came out to the scene. You could see that smoke billowing all the way from the Crosstown Expressway. Fire crews have been on the scene for over two hours putting water on those bright orange flames that consume part of the condo complex. Uh, that part that was heavily involved was the, the part that was facing the beach. Now we're told, uh, just did an interview with the fire chief, Brandon Wade. He told us about 15 units and all were affected. At this point, no injuries, no firefighter injuries, no resident injuries, anything like that. The Red Cross has been called out here. But you know, there were numerous people out here watching this effort. We're told it was a four alarm response involving 18 fire units, three medic units on the scene. And I am told that crews will be here for several hours and it might be uh, the morning before they get a wrap up on this fire. No word on a cause at this point, but that is the very latest here live on Bill Churchwell. Now back to you. All right, Bill, thank you so much for your report, uh, giving you a live look now from our Lex camera of that scene that Bill is live at from um, you, you can see smoke still billowing from the, the apartment, the condos where firefighters have been this afternoon. As you just heard Bill mention uh, some of the biggest updates, no injuries reported at this hour. That is very good news, but as you could also see, still very much an active scene and we'll be checking back in with him live at six as well.